YouTube, this is Jamie in Transit, and I'm pretty sure this is a first on YouTube for everybody. Um, this is going to be quite the review. This thing is a pain in the dick to get to stand up. So we're going to try and make this a, as best quality review as we can. Um, this inflatable is quite the pain in the ass. Definitely needs to be staked up. Anyways, without further ado, this is the 2018 Projection Airblown Pirate Archway. And this is sold at Lowe's this year, as you can see. Um, they have not changed the box style. I thought they would because they did the year before. So if you want this item for yourself, it is number 0999598. And I got this item for $100 at Lowe's yesterday, the day before. I can't remember. I've gotten a lot lately, but um, this guy is really cool. As you can see, it does come with the, tri the uh, rectangular box. And um, it really, you know, it's cool. There's just not a whole lot of detail to it. Um, it is very nice though. I do like this inflatable a lot. Uh, it is LED. Give you some details on the box there. Airblown Projection Pirate Archway Inflatable. And it says it in whatever language that is. I think it's just Spanish. But And it is LED. The nice thing about it is it does have two ink cans in the torches. So that's what Let's pick it up here. You know what? I'll get back to you in a second. So here we go. I have it set up right here next to my little cardboard cutout so I can safely not scratch the base because I'm very, very anal about my inflatables not getting scratched before the season, even though that's what they're made to do. So here are the lo new Lowe's instructions. They really look the same as usual. And interestingly enough, it does say holiday living on the flyer for the instructions, not haunted living. We'll set that over there. And if you're wondering, it does come with the same base stakes and tethers that at home is selling this year. Give you a better view. The spiked ones. And here's the inflatable itself. I do still have it in the bag, as you can see. Um, I will get back to you when I have it out. So here we go. I have it all laid out. And one detail I really enjoy about this inflatable to the fullest is it does have the metallic fabric on the torches. Sort of similar to the Minions, except gold. And I'll give you a view of the base. It is a typical YAF 80 midsize. That's what I call it, midsize. It's not a slow starter. It is a midsize. So... So you can get the cord untangled here real quick and we shall plug it in for you guys so let's get this turned i'm getting fat i need to bend down and get my stomach out of my face so here we go if i can get this to work not on its side my apologies there we go all right without further ado here we go so you can see it is inflating pretty quickly hopefully we can get it to stand up There's the fire and ice projector there. And no, it is not a fire and ice kaleidoscope. It is a fire and ice projector. Kaleidoscopes are different from the fire and ice. They project differently. So he's taking a minute to inflate. There's the skull. You can see he's starting to go up. This is hard to do with one hand, trust me. Alrighty, so he's fully set up. Uh, let's move him to the side. There we go. Oh, sweet. He's standing. Okay, cool. So there he is. This is a sweet inflatable. I really enjoy it. So you can see it's got the two C7s and the torches. Not C7, the incandescents. Right there. And he's going back. Oh, okay. That's actually fine. I don't mind if it's leaning like that. So it is nine feet tall. I do believe it's a little, a little taller, excuse me. I'll give you a view of it with the lights off. So there we go. It looks really nice with the lights off. Lights up really nicely. It doesn't come up well on camera, but you can see the fire and ice projector is not quite aligned. Um, although it does show up nicely. It does give the skull quite a spooky glow. Give you a view from the back. It doesn't look like much from the back. But that's what it looks like. You can actually see inside the skull there. But overall, this is a really nice inflatable. I do enjoy it. Definitely worth the $99 to pay um, and yeah this is really not a bad inflatable I really like this guy it does have the tassels there in the middle those little tassels this inflatable is really cool um, so Lowe's $99 go pick one up for yourself and I hope you guys enjoyed this video and I will get to you guys soon with another one see ya